I'm going to share with you another handy tool that you can use in your SEO in your keyword research. Some of you may already know this keyword.io, but the good thing about this, it's free. You can use it whenever you want and it has good number of limits so you don't get exhaust too fast. For example, if you are concerned about credits running out, so that's fine. This will give you a lot of rate limits per day you can request. So this is a free keyword tool that you can use. You can actually use their interface right here. So if you go to this one, Google auto suggests long tail keywords, and you will be able to type a seed keyword right here, and you'll be presented with keyword ideas that you can use in your, let's say for something like this, some many keywords, and then click on search and you will get hundreds of them right here. So you got a bunch of keyword ideas that you can use as topic for your blog or for your YouTube channel, whatever social media you are running, you can do that. And what's good about this, you can also search YouTube, Amazon, Bing, anything here using this tool right here. And another handy approach you can try for this tool right here is using their API. They have an available API if you want to integrate it in your system. I'm going to show you a quick example. So let's say you want to have your own long tail keyword generation. What you just need to do, copy this command right here, go to Gemini and make sure you are selecting uh, the Gemini 2.5 Pro. Now you will ask Gemini to create a simple JavaScript interface to interact with their API right here. So just paste the sample command right here, the curl command, and this will create you a beautiful interface that you can use right away. So let's do that now. And look at this guys, in just a few seconds, Gemini 2.5 Pro was able to create you this beautiful application that you can use now. So let's see if it's going to work. So let's type our keyword as a uh, cat training. Now, you will have the API token when you sign up here. So you will grab them right away. You will see them right away along with the API endpoint. And you can use that to create your own application. Now, going back here in the keyword. So let's see if this is able to present us the keyword results. So you did have pasted the API response as well. So that Gemini 2.5 Pro will understand how the application will be presented. But let's see. There might be some issue because we haven't pasted the sample response so Gemini can actually render how we will need to display the response so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna copy this and come back here as you can see it just resulted with the actual JSON but look at this the data that you will be able to get from here so we will tell Gemini to have the response so we will tell Gemini to put it in a readable nice table format and put our sample response just like that all right and then run it and there you go, guys. So Gemini completed the modification of our application right here. Again, let's do another query right here. Let's say dog training and keep everything as is. Now, take these fetch keywords. So I think I overuse my PP limit because I am using it since morning. But you can just come here to this website right here and grab a free account. Now, feed all this data to an application like Gemini or Claude. Uh, whichever you prefer and ask it to create a beautiful UI for you so that you can always use that to integrate in your own website or in your own SEO automation. You can also use their interface right here so you can see if you are going to research for Bing auto suggest keywords, you can do that so you can come right here and let's say here I want to search for this seed phrase and let's see if Bing can come up with some keyword suggestions. And there you go, guys. So these are the keywords that have been recorded in Bing recently that people were searching for. So you can use this to implement as your blog post or create contents for your YouTube channels, things like that. So this is really a handy tool. So again, you don't have to follow every exactly the method I recommend. It's just for you to give some inspiration that it may spark some ideas and can help you with your own affiliate marketing or doing SEO contents things like that. So I'm just sharing you some useful tools that I think may be handy, especially if you're just starting with this approach, uh, creating SEO, creating contents, or making or growing your YouTube channel, things like that. So if you want this type of content, um, uh, leave a like and don't forget to comment down below if you need anything. If you have any suggestion, if you have any question, let me know in the comment. See you on the next one and thank you for watching.